Good morning, Good morning everyone. everyone. Uh, it's a really honor for me to present our experience in CG's meeting today. Today, my topic is optimal typing, uh, timing for laparoscopic cholestectomy after percutaneous cutaneous transhepatic gallbladder drainage. drainage. I have nothing to disclose. In Tokyo guidelines published in 2013 for the management of acute cholestitis, the patient with uh, grade 1 and grade 2 acute cholestitis, early or emergency laparoscopic cholestitis, uh, cholestectomy is recommended. And the patient with severe cholestitis in grade 3 or grade 2 patient with, uh, who do not respond to the initial treatment, urgent uh, GB drainage is recommended as the uh, choice. Although there are many reports assessing the timing of laparoscopic cholestectomy after GBD, the optimum timing of surgery after GBD is yet to be clarified. We usually plan elective uh, surgery more than 30 days after GBD to allow information to subside and the patient to recover their general condition. The aim of this study was to assess the optimal time interval for laparoscopic cholestectomy after GBD and clarify the validity of the, our strategy. We retrospectively reviewed uh, the medical records in GK University Hospital and GK University Kashiwa Hospital between January 2, 2006 and March 2015. 79 patients underwent laparoscopic cholestectomy after gallbladder drainage. We divided those patients into two groups. For under 30 group, uh, patients were underwent uh, cholestectomy equal to or less than 30 days. And for over 30 group, uh, we planned uh, cholestectomy more than 30 days after uh, gallbladder drainage. Elective uh, surgery was generally planned more than 30 days after gallbladder drainage and analyzed the patient clinical backgrounds and operative factors. These are the characteristics of our 79 patients. Median age was 66 years old and 68% of patients were male. Severe, uh, severity grading uh, according to TG13 Grade 1 in 36 patients, uh, grade 2 in 37, and grade 3 in 6 patients. The interval from onset to all the uh, onset of to gallbladder drainage was two days, and interval from gallbladder drainage and electrosurgery varied uh, significantly from 0 to 274 days. The median uh, operative time was 160 minutes and blood loss was 10 grams. The overall conversion rate of, to open surgery was 27% with median post-operative hospital stay of 5 days. We had uh, 21 patients in under 30 group who were treated with early cholestectomy um, this, this is a, a list of the reasons. <coughs> the majority of the patients were uh, treated with oral cholestectomy because of the patient's preference for oral surgery. And three patients uh, had uh, a medical history to take uh, anticoagulant. So, and some patients are in, uh, with uh, ineffective PTGBD. When com uh, when Comparing the uh, under 30 and over 30 group, no significant difference in, uh, was observed in patient background and pre-op data, including age, sex, severity score, uh, pre-GBD white blood cell counts, and pre-GBD serum uh, CRP levels. The interval between GBD to uh, elective operation is different in both groups. The, yeah. There's no significant difference in operation time and intraoperative blood loss. And conversion rate uh, in under 30 group was 33% and 24% in over 30 group without significant difference. 
uh, uh, post opera post just stay was similar in both groups, but uh, total tr treatment period from GBD to discharge from, from the hospital after elective surgery is statistically shorter in under 30 group. There, uh, the total complication rate was 90% uh, in both groups. There was one bile duct injury occurred in over 30 group, which required choreographic genostomy. We had uh, experienced one uh, early global uh, uh, GBD-related uh, complication at the time of the insertion of the gargoyle uh, drainage tube. Uh, the tube was dis uh, dislodgement, dislodged in intraperitoneally, and the patient developed the peritonitis and required uh, emergency cholecystectomy on the same day uh, of PTGBD uh, attempt. We had uh, nine, total, total nine late GBD-related complications, and five out of eight patients in over 30 group uh, required uh, emergency cholecystectomy. There are several uh, literature uh, comparing the early and late uh, elective surgery after GBD. But uh, each also has uh, or uses uh, different cut -off cut of peers in their uh, papers. Uh, top, in top three papers, in, uh, top, top three papers recommend uh, the late elective course take me uh, with the preferable results in operation time complication rates. And the two, two papers uh, bottom uh, show the recommend the early elective surgery uh, with uh, lower conversion, conversion rate and uh, shorter operation time. In our present study, uh, there's no difference in uh, conversion rate and complication rate, but the total treatment period was significantly shorter in under 30, day, uh, under 30 groups. In over 30 group, five patients required emergency surgery due to the PTGBD cast or dislodgement during uh, waiting for the elective surgery. Conversion rate was higher than 30% in uh, under 30 groups. However, total treatment period was shorter. Conclusion, early elective laparoscopic cholecystectomy after GBD seems to be safe treatment option for patients with acute cholecystitis because of short total treatment period and acceptable complication rate. Thank you for your attention.